Before the start of the semester, we need to make sure that two things are set in each course so that students can access the course without any problems. Those two things are one, is for the course to be visible to students, and two, for students to be enrolled in the course. By default, the courses are not visible to students. We know a course is visible when it's this color, dark blue. If a course is grayed out, then it's not visible to students. A way to check for that is to go to Edit Settings. You have a lot of options, but just scroll down to the part that it says Availability. In Availability, just check that it says this course is available to students. If the course says that it's not available to students, it won't be available to students. Change it to the setting that you want to change it to and click Save Changes. Instructors are given this ability to set a course to not visible or visible so that they can prepare the course before it is available to all students in their course. To then check if students are enrolled in your course, click on go to the settings panel. This is the settings panel to the left side of the screen. Click on users, go to enrolled users, and here you'll be able to see whether students are enrolled in your course. If for some reason you do not see students there enrolled in your course, go to enrollment methods and select UMN out of enrollment. When you do this, you'll be able to see which courses you are able to add students or remove students from your course. And then, once you added or removed the group of students that you want to add to your course, click Update Course Enrollment. This system links Moodle to PeopleSoft. It allows for Moodle to automatically enroll students and withdraw students depending on their registration status. If a student drops out of a course, they'll be automatically removed from Moodle and you won't have to remove them manually. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, please contact us at ssw.edtel.umn.edu. Thank you.